When you chant the Maha Mantra, Krishna is personally dancing on your tongue. Mm -hmm. He's he's there with you. And if you practice it really purely, one can reach stages of bliss and ecstasy. I mean, I have tasted that for a glimpse, but not not in that state every day. Maharani is a devotee of Hare Krishna. She was born marrying Elliot. You might remember her other incarnation. I think after I saw that UFO, um, that I did have slightly different questions to ask. Maybe there's something more to life that I should find out about. Polly split the specs in 81 and joined the Hare Krishna movement. She has been lured by a touch of Eastern promise into making occasional records with artists like Boy George and here, the Dream Academy. It's always flattering uh, to be asked to do other things with other people and if I think that they're cool, I'll do it if I like what they do. And so, from chaos to karma, the madness of the 70s has given way to mantras and meditation. I'm not too stressed out about anything, too much materially. It's like I'm not going to spend my whole life striving for things that are very difficult to obtain when I might as well try and obtain something spiritual, which I can take with me to my next birth. <laughs>